right we are checking out a, a target here i don't go to this one often but it looks like they have some series two of the marvel trucks but of course not all of them we are still needing the captain america and spider-man one but we have the iron man which is my least favorite marvel truck and then black panther which is probably my most next to thor so that's cool that this is here still looking for the thor truck i know they're hitting walmart's about to check some walmart's now it is uh wednesday night hoping to find that thor i really really do want to find that but good start here first store i really have gone to this evening i went to another target but they didn't have this but unfortunately it's like 9 30 p.m and all the targets close in 30 minutes and i'm starting to hit some walmarts today so well there's some mystery motors right there if i can find a section like that for the marble chucks that'd be perfect but for right now i guess i'm gonna be only getting these two tonight hopefully maybe this video will continue over to the next time i can get out to a uh, target um but for now only have half of the case of course okay so i was able to make it out to another target because this one actually closes at 11 it's like 10 15 or something and it looks like they had series two as well at one point but this is the only one that they have left which we already do have that one and it's 20 percent off monster jam stuff so unfortunately we cannot complete the collection tonight of series two marvels but um yeah and then all of those they're literally just normal iron man's so annoying i'm sure this was put out this morning i know each of those new trucks from series two are selling from 20 to 30 dollars a piece so spider-man one's like a 25 dollar piece can't wait to find that one. looking at a few stores tonight and first one starting off decently strong what makes is that 34 look they, they got a series two of marvel trucks and captain america sitting right there no spider-man guys no spider-man they have a what in the world okay well i thought that was going to be something cooler but just some dirt squads they got the new nine packs as well second time seeing those but there is nothing else they got the shoe truck got the minis four yeah all right well this is all i'm going to be picking up here too bad that we just cannot finish it i know that spider-man is it's pretty rare it's the worst one out of the four but we're still going to keep looking guys those are all three right there all right guys we are back at the walmart here and look at that they got series two of the marvel trucks nothing else to note but um i don't know if they're gonna have spider-man the last one that i need of course there's iron man captain america black panther black panther black panther another captain america captain america iron man oh spider-man in the very back the very last one come on now there we go there it is spider-man we can finally make an actual review video on this set now it's been a few weeks in the making but we got one checking out the target i don't really go to this one but two green light chases back to back there's just no one's gonna pay that and there's nothing crazy nothing fancy new packs again spider-man here struggled to find that and here it is just hanging here they actually don't even have the full set they have two black panthers and iron man and then that's spider-man i actually like their section here they have a good section for outless monster trucks let's see if they have a snake bite no snake bite here that's good to know they are still not peg warming um they had this new set this japanese set that's pretty cool five packs here it's pretty loaded i just wish they had series 37 it has been spotted all this week um as close to here as like michigan and utah hasn't made it really on the east coast yet but it's only a matter of time we are back home guys i got a lot of cool hot wheels from the new p case of this year and guys you think the monster jam scene is hard to get into and find the good stuff that are sought after it is nothing compared to hot wheels guys i go into walmart tonight for hot wheels boxes open several collectors they're going through and i was able to pull out the ones that you see here that would be the super i'm pretty sure one of the boxes had a super but i could be wrong but i just want to show you all of them a couple muscle cars there jdm i have it all organized we got a couple tunes super right there the new gordon murray car mclaren 4gt lambo koenigsegg 4gt race viper and the tesla with that said let's get to the monster trucks i just wanted to show you guys that that is a really cool lineup of cars let's get right into it guys we're going to start off with obviously the least coolest one of the mix the most underwhelming i would say is the iron man i'm just not a big fan of how the iron man looks in general and i probably have about four or five of this variant so far i have two mystery butters i have the series one i have the five pack now i have the series two and that's just for 164s i have one or two of the minis as well however many they've came out with so far so definitely quite a few i'm just missing some 124s now um it's only a matter of time till they come out with those i'm sure but here it is let's look at it i think they came out with one of the two packs too didn't they i don't remember let's get it open guys 
oh yeah i forgot at least they are going to be coming with the flag that's cool even though we got flags for all these the only new one will be spider-man we don't have a spider-man flag yet but here is the iron man one i don't know if that's any different from the one from series one but this is the series two one it's a little sticky around this part right here i think that's probably from the tape i may have ripped it off um not right but here is the truck it does look all right i like the uh the kind of yellowish or so roll cage red base red tires black bkt's on the tires pretty cool gray rims um i don't know just another variant but um i do like the bkt's that's a decent touch i like the black bkt's blacked out we don't see that too often so there is that and of course let's let's put the flag on it real quick give me a second i like that they do these flag series like that all right we're gonna put that in the back there and see how far it'll roll all right that's fine it can stay right where it is at all right we're gonna look at the captain america next even though this one was harder for me to find than black panther i found this tonight and i found the black panther like a couple weeks ago with the iron man i just like the black panther more so we're gonna say black panther for second to last and let's look at the captain america although i will admit the captain america one is growing on me and i do like this variant of it i like that that base color or not the base color the roll cage color all right there we are let's get the flag out let me try to rip the flag out of the tape without making the flag sticky maybe if i can yeah i don't know if that's gonna happen the flag's still sticky that's a little flaw this the the tape that sticks the flag down it wraps around this part of the flag right here and it kind of makes it uh, sticky after you take the tape off that kind of sucks but there's the captain america flag and here is the truck i have reviewed all these trucks before even spider-man just not in this series so these are all just new variants of the marvel trucks but we are going to be getting series two of the double pack somewhat soon but here's the captain america gray roll cage red base blue wheels black tires the white b kts on the tires and there is a quick little 360 of what captain america looks like if by chance you have not seen that one yet there you go i don't think these are gonna stay we're gonna try to put it back there like that still have room for the final two let's look at the black panther i like the purple do like the purple vest for sure here is the black panther from series two you guys can see where it says two as well i just realized that right above the marvel logo that's cool let's take it out of the box I'm definitely going to have to see after this video if uh, these flags are different than the one from Series 1. They're on my shelf. I'll probably put in the bottom left corner down there if uh, they are the same or not. All right, this flag did not get as sticky, but here is the flag. I like that they come with accessories. It's unfortunate that they have to be $4.97 or $4.99, a dollar extra than normal trucks just to get this accessory. But look at this, guys. We have like a light purple on the BKT tires. Definitely a different shade of purple than the purple tire color. I like that purple base the base kind of looks like a lighter purple than the roll cage the base is the same color as the wheels and the roll cage is a slightly darker color than those two the tire and the the base that roll cage color is a little darker than those that's pretty cool and i like the black on the wheels black it out looks a little cleaner here is the black panther itself do like this one a lot you have the honeycomb pattern on the back i've already reviewed this it was actually quite recently when i reviewed this let me put the flags on these trucks i did i put it on iron man but not these two here there's captain america there is the black panther and that leaves room for one more guys let's get it out guys i was so upset as i was recording guys i was looking through all the marvel trucks they had from series two they had them all they had like several of each of these three that you're looking at right now and i get to the very last one i'm like of course they're not gonna have it in the very last one in the back there in the very back they had the spider-man at the short pump virginia richmond walmart yeah that's right walmart guys i've been seeing it at target i have not seen these at walmart but they did get it so here it is let's get it out of the box finally spider-man in the mainline series other than a two pack and five pack release we've still gotten i got i think four variants of spider-man we got the two pack like i said we got a mystery mutter we got the five pack and I, this is now our fourth one. So let's get the flag out. Here it is. There's the Spider-Man flag. Never seen before. Definitely don't have one of these yet since it is the first time we're seeing it in main lines. There it is. The Amazing Spider-Man. Not a very clean looking casting. They put baby blue on the, the base, which I don't understand that. The truck, I mean, this part of the blue is kind of baby blue. But this is mainly a black and red truck. There is a little bit of blue stripes on the top but even that color blue is a lot darker than the blue on the base so i'm not too i'm not too fond of that but we do have a red uh, roll cage that kind of matches i don't really mind it i do like the red wheels i wish they would have done like a a black base and maybe like a gray roll cage 
with these red wheels and the white BKTs on the tires, black tires, of course. I think that would have looked a lot more cleaner, but this is what the Spider-Man looks like. Not too bad. I do like how the Spider-Man looks. We have the big 3D spider on the roof there, like I just displayed. And that is all four of them, guys. Let's set that right there. And those are all four of the trucks from Series 2 of the Marvels. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, and of course, subscribe. Which one's your favorite? I'm still going to probably have to go with Black Panther. That is my favorite next to Thor. But obviously, Thor was not in this series. Now I have every single Marvel truck out there. So I want to give you guys a more unique question than usual. Should I do a downhill racing on my Shaw Showdown ramp down there with all the Marvel variants? All these, all the ones from this five pack, all from Series 1, all from the two packs and then maybe one of each of the mutters i don't know let me know i'll see you guys in the next video with that said peace out